Hey all brothers and sisters, my name is Captain Meatshield and welcome to Sanitarium. This is going to be our new horror, horror themed point and click retro let's play. This is something I played loads of when I was a kid. Uh, this is from 1998, if I remember correctly. And Fine. it's very it. bizarre. I found the answer. All those years, I should have seen it. There's more. I'll, I'll, I'll tell you when I get home. I don't quite remember much of the story, but it's, it's, it's very kind of, what I remember of it is it's not particularly, I, I don't remember it being particularly upfront with what exactly is going on, but we play as a dude who knows, knows something important, and then this happens. Hmm. We nicked that car. What, what's happening? Where, where am I? You, mate, are in a... Oh, I forgot about the horrid noise you make. Uh, he, he eventually ends up on the USG Ishimura, where he eventually stops banging his head quite so bad. Um, but yes, this is Sanitarium. Um, oh, right, yeah, I've got to remember how the controls work, so... It's horrible! What kind of place is this? It's a sanitarium. It's a really nasty place. Ugh, these beds are filthy. They, they really are. Okay, I think the first thing I want to do is... Switch. Must control the alarm. Yeah, can we just turn that off? Because it's kind of annoying. Finally, uh, that thing was driving me crazy. Interesting choice of words there, mate. Right. So, we've got to try and... It just The game just throws you in. It, Another bed. Ugh, smells like it's soaked with urine. Ugh, it's not nice. So yeah, the, the game just throws you into this. There's no real kind of explanation of, oh, oh fucking giant rat, bloody hell. I don't remember seeing you. Can't expect that. Is there anything in this room? What horrible living conditions. They are horrible. I do remember I need this. It might be useful. It might be. Let's pick that up. So, how, how is it I... Ah, there we go, that's how I access my uh, inventory. So, up we go. We've got this weird angel statue. I remember you being important. Strange and beautiful sculpture. It was... There's a locking mechanism in the base. Yes. But what for? Yeah, that's what we've got to try and figure out. We've got to find a thing to unlock that, and then I think we get to progress further. Um, let's see if we... Diagnosis? Crazy. Hmm. Something to that effect. I won't do, 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 do it! I won't face your volcano! Or... At least this one looks friendly enough to talk to. Are you sure about that? Well, I guess we better go and chat with the old Joker teeth. Can right. I ask you something? Can I ask your name? The the don I haven't heard you before. Who... Who are you? I wish I knew. I, I can't remember my name. I was hoping you might know me. Stupid voice. Are you a sp sp spirit? Uh, not quite. I don't even know. Um, yeah, so our character has amnesia from his crash. Um, it's like, f from what I, like, th things do get quite strange. Like, it's not all quite based in... Uh, sort of reality. Things will shift as we kind of progress through and kind of get a bit weird and wonderful, if you want to put it in that, those many words. Uh, right. I'm no spirit, just a man like you. Like me? The, the, then you can hear the voices too, can't you? I'm not sure. These voices, spirits, ghosts, whatever they are, who are they? The fallen warriors. They demand vengeance! Uh, vengeance, you say? What is it they're demanding vengeance for? T -t -t temples The fallen temples! C -c Can't you hear them? C -c Crying out? Is this the temple? Is this place one of the fallen temples? No, 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 no. If you don't know, know, know that, you're not the warrior I thought you to be. 
Well, damn. <laughs> All right, where are we? Something here is familiar. I keep thinking I'll get it. Where are we? I know something that you don't. <laughs> this, this is the the village. St stupid voice. What village? Doesn't this place have a real name? Of, of course. It's the village. The b b best place for people like you and me. The doctor here has resource. Resource. Re. He's very good, <laughs> Dr. Morgan. He s s says I'm lucky to be here, and so you must be lucky too. Good for you. Well done. Oh, well, I'm glad to hear about that. Wait, let's ask about this Dr. Morgan. How can I find this Dr. Morgan? I think I need to talk to him. He'll find you. The b b best witch doctor in the land he is. He'll save us. Can you tell me where anyone is? Dr. Morgan, anyone? They f fled. Coward. No, 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 not, not great warriors like us. Oh, but not Morgan. He'll f find us. Hmm. Right. Last question, I think. Why are you in this place? What brought you here? Isn't it obvious? I did, did, did ding from him. Him? I don't. She, sh shut up, or he'll hear you, stupid voice. Hmm. Okay. Goodbye. Uh, the him, I think, is meant to be kind of like either, either presumably God, I think. If I remember right. This has got some. This does have quite somewhat of like. A, whoa! <laughs> I forgot about that bit. Some sort of like religious overtones to it. I only ever completed the game once, um, so I don't remember like a huge detail of it. I remember this bit because I had a demo of the game as a kid, which I played endlessly. Um, I forgot you were in here. Didn't know the room was occupied. Seems familiar. Can't quite remember. Mm. Can we talk to you? Oh, we can. Hello. I don't believe I know you. What's your name? Lenny. I'm Lenny. Lenny's my name. Hi, Lenny. Well then, you must be Lenny. <laughs> you wouldn't happen to know my name, would you? Nope. Mom says not to talk to strangers. Your mum is a wise person. Uh, right. Where are we? Lenny, do you know where we are? This is my room. My bedroom. Do you like it? Bedroom? <laughs> no, I mean the building. What's this place we're in? What's it called? My house. <laughs> Something tells me we're not going to get a straight answer out of any of these people, are we? This isn't your house. Yes, it is. <laughs> Why are you here, Lenny? Can you tell me that? I was very, very bad. Oh, dear. I can't believe that of you, Lenny. What did you do? I, uh... I ate some pumpkin pie. Oh. Hi. How could you get in trouble for that? It came from the pack. A pumpkin patch? Where is it? Where? We're not getting sensible answers out of you, are we? Where is everyone, Lenny? Where you should be. You should listen. Mother make them all go away. I think he considers the statue like mother. She's got this kind of like. Um, comforting, comforting presence of like some sort of security and I must not have heard stuff. her. Uh, Lenny, where did she tell them to go to? To school. Yeah, she made them go to school. Since I didn't hear your mom, can you tell me how to get to school? Translation: No. <laughs> All right. Goodbye. All right. Uh, we're gonna go this way. I think we need to inspect things down here. Are you alright, mate? Uh, oh god, I forgot! Him with his pants down! Bye! <laughs> oh. My god! I know, right? That must be the generator. They said it could explode any minute. How do we get out of here? Oh, we gotta find a way. What's he doing huddled in the corner? Trying to hide? Oh, maybe you should go and ask him some questions. How am I supposed to? Not from here. Go up here then. There we are. Excuse me. 
Do I know you? Your name is... Uh... Martin. Martin, I said. Uh... Like Father Martin? Do you, know... Do you know who? Can you tell me my name? How the hell should I know? How can you stand all of them? Buzzing. It's constantly buzzing. He either doesn't like bees or microwaves, and I'm not sure which. Right. What is this place? Uh, nut house. You nut house? It looks At least so he's cold. given us one straight mean? answer so far. Nut house. Rooney bin. Funny farm. What don't you understand? Well, there's a lot I don't understand. For starters, why are you here? Damn bugs. Are driving me crazy. I'll find their hide. Doc, Morgan's a great help. We'll squash them. That'll be that. Hmm. Another another mention of Doctor Morgan. What bugs, Martin? I don't see any. Maybe they're not real. Are you serious? These blood-sucking insects are bent on destroying the world. Martin. Think about it. How are some bugs going to destroy the world? Well, look at them. These aren't normal bugs. These is robots. <laughs> Little eeny, eeny robots. So he's scared of nanomachines. That's what he's scared of. There's a doctor around here? Doc Morgan? Dr. Nator. That's what he is. The best there is. He kills bugs. Dead. Always come back. <laughs> Always come back. Yeah. These people, I I do feel sorry for. Where is everyone? How? All of them. When the alarm went off, they left us behind. You know, with the bugs. Wait till Doc Morgan finds out. It's a conspiracy. I bet it is. Right. Now, we need to get over to this little tower. It's like a security office. So, that towel that we picked up is going to come in handy. So, we got to go... Oh, no, not back down the stairs. Oh, you got to love, like, clunky 90s controls, haven't you? That's why we play these games. For, for you know, mostly for rage. <laughs> Um, just awkwardness. Towel. Right, I need my towel. I need to use it on this. Makeshift zipline is go! Whoosh! Yeah! Uh, right, if I... Looks like some sort of control panel. Yeah, press that. that. Extends the bridge for me. Ah, uh, now we're getting somewhere. Indeed we are. Ooh, hi bats! How's it going? Uh, let's let ourselves in here. And have a look, look see at what we find. So, right, now I need to figure out what stuff I can go with. are held shut by an electronic lock. Oh, yeah, we've got to... There must be something valuable in there. But how do I open it? So there's a safe. That's not right. Hmm. Right. Hmm, what's wrong with this thing? Hmm, the cables need to be plugged in before I can use the VCR. All right, here we go. So we've got our first little puzzle which isn't particularly difficult just match the cables up and plunk good right uh, just play isn't it yeah can you hear me it's dr. Morgan your delusions almost took the life from you this time my face it's in bandages where am I who am I you must have thought you had somewhere important to go when you stole that car. Oh, no. You did a lot of damage to that face of yours in the crash. I'm sorry. I, I can't believe. No apologies. All we need is your best effort. And before you can give us that, you need some rest. Bruce, help our lad back to his room. Don't worry, son. We'll talk again soon. Oh, hello, after image. Oh, Whoa. that opened that everything there. Opened the safe. Nice. Okay. Um, yeah, I'm trying to remember whether or not the um, like our protagonist, whether he was 
like possibly one of the staff or like I can't imagine him being a patient I don't remember if he was a patient initially I think he was one of the staff who just you know obviously discovered something and then tried to get out so that he could you know sort of like sort of like the whistleblower in, in Outlast you know trying to get the information out to the real world or to the rest of the world could be answers in here let's have a rifle through see if we can find something right, there's a memo a memo regarding the tower bridge Due to recent problems with the generator, all employees are asked to keep the tower bridge extended at all times. It will be extremely difficult to extend the bridge from the outer ring should the power go out. Yeah. Uh, right, the key. A letter for Dr. Morgan from a Professor Cunningham. Something about an ancient key found here in the asylum. The key you described must be very old indeed. I have found documentation that may link it to Aztec culture. Though we'd have to examine the object carefully here at the Institute in order to confirm this theory. Mmm. Secretive stuff. Memo from the Chief of Security. It gives some details about a patient escape. Number 227. The memo says that the West Wing is inadequately contained. And all the patients have been transferred to the tower cells. Here. But where are they now? It's a very good question. I'm wondering if you were patient 227. Oh, but we found... A strange kind of key. Yeah. Key to what? Well, I think we might know. I think it's our big old angel statue. So... We should go and plug that in, and see what happens with it. Right. Give me my key. Plug it in here. Clunk. Yeah, there we go. So, like, yeah, I thought it brought the statue to life. Ah, uh, it is no, it is so dark. Oh my own once bright tower, what has become of you? You, you're alive. Am I going mad? Listen, hear the cries of the children. Innocent are dying, and you only think of yourself. Can you not see the light of heaven has dimmed? What? What can I do? Seek the truth. Yeah, I'll get on that right now. Wait, there we go. So, yeah, that's 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 how the game starts. Uh, I think I'm gonna wrap it up there because that's like just the first section of the game done. There's oh, I can't remember exactly how many like areas we go to. I think it's like six or seven or something like that. So I might try and do just like a single one per uh, video. Uh, next episode we'll try and uh, get our way through this area. Yeah, quiet time is nice time. <laughs> but. Yeah, oh man, this does bring back some memories. And I hope that you guys are going to be interested in seeing how this one plays out. Like I said, it's a very bizarre game. I've never really known what kind what kind of goes on. Um, certainly certainly don't remember all that well if I ever did know like what actually happens in this. But hopefully we'll try and figure it all out together. Uh, I'm looking forward to replaying this and refreshing refreshing my memory with it. So for now, I'm going to wrap this episode up here and just say thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, check out the playlist on the channel for more Let's Plays on Metal Covers and give this video a like or a comment just to leave your thoughts. And if you wish to join the ever-growing ranks of the Order of the Shield, subscribe on YouTube, chuck me a follow over on Twitch, or maybe even consider checking out my Patreon and becoming an officer within the ranks. But thank you again for watching this video, and I will catch you all very, very soon. This is Captain Meat Shield, signing off.
fire it up. <laughs> Achievement unlocked, butthurt.